Hop a day and good evening. I'm Nurse Jen. Welcome to Go Healthy. In this segment, let's discuss dwarfism, medically referred to as a chondroplasia. Dwarfism is a genetic condition that affects 1 in 15 to 40,000 people. A person diagnosed with dwarfism has an inherited altered FGFR3 gene from one or two affected parents. Common signs are short stature, less than 4'10", short arms, and short legs. Dwarfism itself is not a disease. However, their proper medical care must be treated for dwarfs or little people so they can live long and active lives. There are three types of dwarfisms. Disproportionate dwarfism, proportionate dwarfism, and then there's the local dwarfism. Disproportionate dwarfism is when one body part is small and the others are average size or above average size. Proportionate dwarfism is when all the body parts are small. And the third one, local dwarfism, is when one can't reach the top shelf to get that can of spam no matter how hard we try. Just joking, there's no such thing as local dwarfism. Signs and symptoms of dwarfism often present at birth or early in infancy. Now, let's head into this week's trivia question. What is the most common form of medical treatment for people diagnosed with dwarfism? A, IV or medication therapy? B, surgical intervention? Or C, genetic counseling and individual therapy? The correct answer is C, genetic counseling and individual therapy. There is a long history of people with dwarfism treated as spectacles for entertainment, while others are vulnerable to teasing and ridicule. I'm Nurse Jen, reminding you to be healthy is to go healthy.